Today is the last day of World Immunization Week. Celebrated every year in the last week of April, the day aims to promote the use of vaccines to protect people of all ages against diseases. With the theme, Vaccines Bring Us Closer, we speak to Dr. T. Kok Kang, Senior Lecturer at the Department of Medical Microbiology, University of Malaya, on the importance of vaccines and how they can save lives. A vaccine is very important because it is one of the different methods to actually produce immunity to a certain disease by stimulating the production of antibodies. One of the best examples I could uh, think of is the polio vaccine, which is a vaccine against polio virus that can cause poliomyelitis. Maybe some of us, um, especially the younger generation, may have not heard about this disease simply because the disease has been successfully eradicated by vaccination many years ago. So in many developed countries nowadays, um, polio disease is no longer existing. And this shows how promising and how effective a vaccine is in eradicating a viral disease. Dr. T debunks the misconceptions surrounding the safety of vaccines and urges for everyone to do the right thing and get vaccinated. There are many misconceptions, unfortunately, uh, towards vaccination and the vaccine itself. I, I think uh, one, one of the most common misconceptions uh, is probably uh, the fact that vaccine is not safe. People are afraid that vaccine can actually uh, elicit certain unwanted immunological responses in our bodies. Um, yes, this can happen, but the percentage or the, or the incidence is actually extremely rare. If you take the recent reports on the AstraZeneca vaccine, in which uh, only four in one million uh, who, who have been vaccinated reported complications, uh, hematological complications, um, um, post-vaccination. And, and these numbers, four in one million, actually reminds me of uh, uh, the um, side effects caused by the polio vaccine, for example. Many years ago, the reported uh, in incidence of um, side effects is also around about four in uh, one million. So, but if you look at what we have today, I mean, we, we, we no longer have polio because the, the disease has been eradicated. So this shows that um, the, um, the so-called adver adverse effects caused by the vaccines, um, the benefits of the vaccine actually outweigh the uh, the complications or the minor adverse effects caused by the vaccine. Education is a form of empowerment in order to enlighten ourselves of the importance of uh, vaccination. And given the current situation, which is really alarming, I think we all have to um, get the right information and take the necessary actions to do what is right for ourselves, for our family, or even for our country.